Russia has long been a leader in missile technology, consistently staying at the forefront of both ballistic and cruise missile development. Even as the United States continues advancing its missile defense systems, Russia is actively pursuing new ways to ensure its missiles can evade these defenses. One of the most ambitious projects underway is a missile designed to reach any global target using technology never before seen in previous missile systems. Known as the Buravesnik, or by its NATO designation SSCX-9 Skyfall, this new missile represents a significant leap forward. Unlike conventional cruise missiles, the Buravesnik is powered by a nuclear propulsion system, which in theory, gives it an almost unlimited range. This means the missile could fly for extended periods, taking unpredictable routes and striking from any direction, greatly complicating interception efforts. First publicly acknowledged by Russia's president in 2018, the Buravesnik's development has been shrouded in secrecy. Nuclear propulsion in a missile is a groundbreaking technology and a highly sensitive endeavor, presenting technical and safety challenges that have never been done before. Between 2017 and 2019, Russia conducted a series of test flights, many of which failed and culminated in a tragic accident that claimed the lives of at least seven specialists. By late 2023, the Russian leadership announced that all necessary testing for the Buravestnik had been completed and suggested the missile could be deployed as early as 2025. The most revolutionary feature of the Buravestnik is its nuclear-powered engine. Unlike conventional missiles that rely on liquid or solid fuel, the Buravestnik's reactor provides it with limitless range. Its propulsion system allows it to fly below the speed of sound, making it more difficult to detect and intercept as subsonic speeds produce less heat and radar signature. The missile can also alter its flight path mid-mission, allowing it to approach targets from unexpected angles. The concept of using nuclear reactors for propulsion is not new. Submarines and aircraft carriers have employed nuclear power for decades. However, miniaturizing a nuclear reactor for use in an airborne missile has never been accomplished before. Russia claims to have overcome this challenge, developing a compact reactor capable of powering a missile-sized vehicle. It will likely be deployed from ground-based launchers or possibly warships. 